Hi there, it's Shell and Clint. Howdy ho, everyone. Howdy ho. Howdy. Oh, <laughs> uh, uh -oh. you guys. So, um, you know, I've been buying some things to stock up because of the coronavirus. I'm kidding. <laughs> I did hear some people were doing that. They were are stocking up, make sure they have plenty of craft supplies. Because, you know, if you're isolated, you may as well enjoy it. Enjoy it. Yeah. So, anyways, I'm always isolated. So, anyways, I was going to show you guys this. And, yeah. Can you see in there? So, this is the start of, like, a haul video because I have more things coming in the next couple of days. I had to carry that a mile <laughs> while I was walking in the snowstorm. It was so heavy. <laughs> so full of it <laughs> and uh, Miss Gwendolyn she said wouldn't it be funny if Clint was carrying all your beads like Santa Claus and then they all spilled all over the ground in a snowstorm couldn't you just imagine those beads sparkling I'm thinking if you knew how many beads Gwendolyn I'm fixing to show you so this this is a haul from uh, dollarbead.com and I will put a link below, but I wanted to share you, with you guys my dollar beads. <laughs> so, ooh, and some of them are loose. That's not good, is it? So, um, yeah, you know, if you've never been to Dollar Bead, if you're into beads, I am like way out of beads. I have used so many of them recently that... I was stocking up, and like I had mentioned in another video, it's kind of like um, the dollar store. You know how you go in the dollar store, you haven't been there forever, and you're just throwing things in the cart? Though I think my cart would have got really full. So yeah, now if you're looking for a certain color, um, dangle, be dangle, keep on watching, you know, be sure and follow us on Etsy because I do, you know, I will be putting up bee dangles quite often. Maybe some other things if I can think of anything I want to put up. So let's kind of go through these. Let me show you what else I got. I purchased a couple of these. They are, um, they're waterproof, what are they called? Tackle boxes. Yeah, those are tackle boxes. So, and I'll put a link below if you want some of these. These are really nice. I have a lot of my um, charms and stuff in these. Sorry, I was going to pull that off. Try not to make too much noise. Here it goes. Sorry, like a band-aid. I know, that was awful. Sorry, guys. But, yeah, so, um, we actually got some of these a while back at the thrift store. For like a dollar, um, three dollars each, I think. And I really love them because whenever I drop my beads, they don't go all over. Yeah, so I'm just going to put a couple of them up real quick. Just so that um, as my loose beads kind of, uh oh, kind of, um, fall out. I can pop them in here. I'm not sure if I'm doing that right. What do the other ones look like? Okay. I don't know. I think maybe that's in a corner or something. So, yeah, I just thought I'd share with you guys. Clint is working on yeah. something over there. It says back. Oh, does it go in this one? Oh. Anyways, I guess it tells you where where they go. So let's take a look at these beads real quick, just to kind of share. Who knows how long this video will be? If it's really long, I will um, go ahead and post it on Friday. But I hadn't planned on you know like doing all this stuff. But I also hadn't planned on opening my beads and having a bunch of loose ones. So, let's pop 
pop this right here. Okay, so anyways, let's see what we have. We have some pretty green ones. Those are pretty. They had a lot of things that were on um, clearance. Yeah. Let's pop these over here. So, just pretty clear beads. Yeah. I think I have plenty to play with now. And they're all glass beads, I believe. I like the heaviness and the heft of glass beads. So, yeah. <laughs> Didn't expect to see this today, did ya? <laughs> Those are pretty. Kind of like a cobalt. And it's pretty simple to, um... Hun, do you see all my beads? Holy smoke. Pretty simple to go on there and order some stuff, you know. Like I said, you kind of get carried away if you have so much. But I really needed to stock up because, like, I had no pink, I had no purple, I had no green. I had, yeah, I pretty much had nothing except brown and peach, I think, is all I have left. But I highly recommend, um dollar bead. They're really inexpensive shipping, even when you buy so much stuff. I don't think they even offer, like, free shipping. I did have to pay shipping, but it wasn't, you know, huge. So, these are going to be really fun. Really fun to play with. <laughs> kind of teal or turquoise. There's some more. So, if you're looking for a certain color, then, you know, leave it in the comment of a, a bee dangle. And I will um, get to work on it. I'm just, you know, I kind of just do my thing and then when I'm done, stick them in the store. Especially like when I have a headache or something and I can't really do, you know, much around the house or anything. Which is like today. So, I wanted to show these so I could kind of just sit back and relax. Oh, those are pretty, pretty green ones. So, yeah, I think I'm definitely set. Yeah, I believe so. <laughs> those look like the same ones. No, they're slightly different. Really pretty ones, though. What I want to get to is the packets, because I did buy some, like, packages of mixed mixed ones. Did you say Chloe went up? Yeah. She went back. Back to bed. <laughs> I told Clint there's going to be a really heavy package coming. No, it's not so snowing, Gwendolyn, so he didn't have to go through a um, feet of snow to drag these home. But it would be pretty, like, on a white background. Look at these. These are kind of cool. Cat eyes, I think, is what they're called. Yeah. Really fun. I see a lot of beadwork in my future. <laughs> but I know several people have... Um, been asking me too if I, huh, if I had blue ones coming, yeah, inquired, blue ones coming, or, you know, something like that, or if I had red beads, so yeah, I can say, yeah, I do now, so, so yeah, that should last me through the end of the month, through my quarantine, I'm kidding, I'm fine, there's nothing wrong with me, <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. Really? <laughs> There's my loose ones. Clint wouldn't go that far. You guys know there's something wrong with me, but you know. Just not that. Just not that. I haven't even left the house in, I think, two or three weeks. Seems like forever. 
been a while. But yeah, I thought I would just bring you guys on and show you and see. Because there's one other package I got today that I'd show you. Ooh, those are pretty. Ooh, those are neat. Too bad I can't remember, you know, what they're called. Because these are kind of, it was like a circle. And then it was like, the circle has been kind of almost deflated. Those are kind of neat. Okay. So. Ooh, those are pretty. Oh, those are hearts. Those are cool. Like I said, when you order so much, you don't remember. <laughs> Plus, it, I was in bed. It was late night. <laughs> <laughs> not sure that's a good thing. Clint's really not sure that's a good thing. No. What in the world did you... And he was going to do the video, guys. But I figured he would just be like, what is she going to do with all this? Crap. <laughs> and where are we going to put all this crap? Hey, I thought of that. I got little containers. So... So, yeah, those are all the links. But So, and then these really cute little ones. I'm going to take them out of their bags, and I'll pop them in this little thing back here. Ooh, those are pretty. Those are probably 4 millimeter, if you're into millimeter size. I just know what size I like to work with. So, this I think was just a, you know, a set of colors. Ooh, those are really pretty. So, you oh. Hmm. Where am I going to put them? I only put two, two things out. I think I'm going to have to separate those a little bit more. So this says front. Where's my back one? Good job of this off. Oh, you didn't? No, I didn't, but I'm just... Is it going to work? I'll make it work. Oops. Okay. Goodness. Okay. This is probably boring, isn't it? Okay, let's just look really quick. See if I can show this to you guys. I don't even know what those are. Maybe a heart? So this is like a red and purple. This is like a green and brown. That's kind of pretty. These are greens. I'm gonna go ahead and take these out. I didn't realize I ordered this size. It's not a size I typically order. But, because they're so tiny. can't even tell what those are. So white. Really pretty beads. These are a big size. Might be bigger than what I normally use. But sometimes you just need one or two big ones. Ooh, look at that heart. That's pretty. don't remember ordering these but I don't think they give like free gifts or anything I doubt, it. I doubt it too but you know that would be nice oh man I dropped my marble <laughs> dropped one, one. Of <laughs> one of many oh you're so funny so yeah that's pretty 
and then there's blue and kind of green big old blue cubes can't tell what that is huh. so yeah if you're you know kind of been up in the air about getting some beads or something then yeah definitely the place to go holy moly that is huge That looks like a brown and red. I'm not sure I like that combo. And then this, which I have no clue what that is. So yeah, so anyways, we got this. I got this, I guess. Clint doesn't really play with them. So, I know that was 15 minutes you'll never get, a, get again. <laughs> you'll never get those 15 minutes back. And then I got something that I placed on Etsy. And I'll show you that real quick. So, yeah. Good deals there. Okay, so, where's my, here it is. And this is from ASC Craft Supplies. Uh, if you remember, that is the, um, paper supply that is having a really good sale right now that I just recently um, told you guys about. But yeah, like everything is 15% off in her store and you don't have to have a um, code. Yeah, it's already, it's already taken. Sorry, my street address is on this one, so I don't want to show that. Huh. Oh, did you get down there? No. Why? Have your street address? No. It's just on here. I have both of them. Oh. Yeah, we, we get all of our mail at the post office, and sometimes not our local mail lady, but the one in charge is like, I'm going to send back all your stuff if you don't start putting a P.O. box on it. Well, that's not the thing, you know. You can't, um... A long time up when you let you put a P.O. box. Yeah, you can't put a P.O. box. So then you have to kind of work around it and say, okay, you know, what else can I do to get this delivered to my house? <laughs> I mean, to my P.O. box because, like, UPS will pass it on to the post, post office. office. So we've, I finally figured out how to do that. So everyone's happy. Oh, she gave me another green pen. I wonder if green's her favorite color. But look at this, guys. <clears throat> oh, isn't that pretty? This is what you came to see, I think. But yeah, 15% off. So, and again, that is at... Huh, she didn't put it on there. That is at A S craftsupplies.com on Etsy and I will put a link below yeah so yeah I don't know if this is yeah I was pretty happy with that so <laughs> open them I've been want wanting to look at it if you guys remember um, the blue and yellow journal that Clint recently made. I'm going to use these papers in that one. In that ATC. For a special, special reason. This is Chow Bella. And yeah, I mean just beautiful papers. Oh, I love this. And look at this little bird. Isn't that adorable? So, I know I have a couple of ATCs planned with this pack. In fact, I've been waiting on this so I could start my next kind of series thing. Kind of Mexican tiles and stuff. Beautiful. Oh, and there's the little birdie again. Beautiful. 
beautiful, beautiful, so fun. Love these, so pretty. Yeah, I messed up. You messed up? So it's not gonna work? No. Clint's moaning in the background about his project not working though. He's feeling so much better, guys. He, yeah. When he jumped over those fences, I think he probably pulled a muscle in his rear end. So then he, well, he, was, that's well done. he wasn't able to walk yesterday. It was pretty bad. I mean, yeah. Every time he'd move, he'd moan. So it was bad. It was, yeah, it was very, very bad. This is a Stamperia. Jeez. Okay. Sorry, I know that's loud. Okay. But I seriously just opened the opened the um Oh, this one's called Precious. Stamp here Precious. Oh, I love those. Can you see the back? Yeah. pretty like I said I don't really have a lot of ideas with these but oh such pretty papers those are pretty Ooh, I have an idea with that right now just popped into my head <laughs> what a scary place to be I know that's what Clint's thinking. Yes, they can be a time. <laughs> so yeah, that one's really pretty. This one is, what is this one? Oh, I only bought three. I thought I bought four. Oh, look at me, hun. See, I saved you some money. I only bought three of them. <laughs> thought I bought a set of four. Yep, saved you some money, hun. Plus they were on sale. <laughs> of course, I didn't save you as much as I would have if I hadn't bought them to start with. But, oh, guys, that is gorgeous. This is um, Blue Fern Studios. Oh, I love them. Look at the bunnies. It's kind of like an Easter feel to it. Yeah, Easter joys. Yeah, it is. I wonder if this is a new one. The carrot. Oh, man, that is beautiful. Oh, hun. Oh, honey. Looks kind of like a basket. a basket weave. Ooh, pretty. So I hadn't even thought about doing an Easter one. And really, I don't even know that I looked to see what these papers, you know, actually looked like. But I love the Blue Fern stu Studio papers because they're so um, hefty. They have a good weight to them. Like the Chow Bella is a little bit thinner. It's not as thin as like a single-sided paper you'd get like at a, the dollar store or something. So, but it's not as hefty as these either. That is so cute. Love it. So pretty. Maybe a Easter TN. That wouldn't that be cute on the cover? I don't know. And then this one. I don't know that you'd need like an Easter, you know, TN. I don't know. Cute though. Oh, I love that. Oh, so pretty. Oh, and then this wreath. That's interesting. The thing for me is, you know, when they're the whole, like a big circle, it's kind of harder to, um, to figure out how to use them. You know, yeah, you can cut it down, you know, eight and a half by eight and a half, but then you're losing a lot of it, but it'd still be really pretty. If I look at the back. Look at that, bunny. That's cute. Wouldn't that be cute as a cover? Hmm. Huh, huh, huh. Oh, I love that. Sorry, they're 
kind of starting to fall. Oh, that's so cute. Six by six. So anyways, that's all I guess we have right now. And she gave me a pen. Another green one. I love the green ones. That's like the ones we got from Brent. ASC by Crystal. My sister's name is Crystal. So, um, yeah, go check out Dollar Bead. And those links will all be below. So thank you guys. And uh, I will probably put the rest of my um, kind of hauls in this video. So I guess I shouldn't say bye. Yeah. But see you soon. Bye. Bye. So I'm sitting here and trying to organize. And yeah. Sophia, she loves anything that clinks or dangles or jingles or anything like that. So she had to come up and join me. But I thought you guys would get a kick out of it. So I thought I'd show you. <laughs> I'm not surprised because she likes it like when Clint is uh, sorting beans or something she wants to go see or, you know, if I'm making a, I thought I had a thing, there it is, but yeah, yeah, so she likes to join us. I know uh, Marilyn, I think, said she was missing her, I think there was a couple others too, missing her Sophia fix. Sophia used to be on the channel all the time. Pretty much every day. Pretty much for a long time and then she... Out of it for Quit coming reason. up. <laughs> yeah, and then she chews on the string, and I have to take it out of her mouth. So yeah, I thought you might might enjoy that. <laughs> everything for your collage. Here. Yeah, I think so. Look at her eyes. Beautiful eyes. <laughs> so yeah, still getting help with Sophia. <laughs> She's too funny, guys. I had her. I had to have her start recording this because she's being such a doofus. Well, and you can tell that I kind of got my um, beads almost filled up. Yeah. So <laughs> she was sound asleep with her head in the thing. Yeah, she's and been then, laying here the whole time. Yeah, and then she woke up, and then she was upside down. And it's like, oh yeah. She's a nut half the time, I tell you. I think she's fixing to leave though. Hopefully. A little stinker. She's not much help, that's for sure. Uh-uh. Oh, she hears daddy talking. I don't know where you're gonna lay. Hi there, it's Shell and Clint. What? Is it always and Clint? Can't it be? Hi, it's oh that wouldn't work since I'm not talking for <laughs> Hi guys, sorry, I don't mean to be a pain. Uh, that's who I am. He's always a pain. Deal with it. You guys know that. He's always a pain. I'm full of piss <laughs> and vinegar. I just woke up from my nap. He did. He's all, yeah, you guys know how it is. So guys, this is a couple of um, TNs. We did get our uh, Hobby Lobby order. <clears throat> but, so I'm going to show you guys that and include it on the front of this, or the back of this video. <clears throat> But yeah, um, Clint made this cover, so he kind of came in, it's like with a blue, and um, then he has like a teal on the back, which is really pretty. So we are fixing to start our, sorry if you guys can hear the goat, I don't know what she's screaming for. That's that time of the month. Is it? Probably. Yeah. That's that. But yeah, it's going to be a TN, and you know, we've made, he has made so many TN covers. So this is going to be one that we're going, I'm going to show you kind of, you know, how to put together a TN. It's pretty simple. I come in with the first two colors, the blue and the yellow. Yeah, the blue and the and, yellow. And, she, and I'm like, uh. <laughs> she thought I was nuts. And I said, yeah, but watch this. And then I put them together. I see. I said, see, I'm right. Yeah. And I was. See, too. I'm right. I and I, I think this yellow may have come from Lisette. I'm not sure. It did, but it's she sent me a lot beautiful. of of the pretty fabrics we've actually been pulling out and using recently. So. Yeah, exactly. But yeah, so he made this one, and then look at this one. I love this one. So this was some scraps that his mother had done, and I'm really like in um, an eclectic mood where I just want to use what I want to use. So like I have a really bright 
yellow paper that I want to use and I thought that'd be kind of fun just to kind of mess with it and see what we could do but yeah he, he came up with this and it's kind of what is this called the design oh it's just patchwork design. oh I thought the corners are and stuff but it's kind of almost like that lattice look that he went oh, for snowball. last time. He, I don't think he's finished decided what he's going to do no. on the inside yet. But yeah, it'll be really bind. pretty. And then he's going to put a little binding around the edge. Yeah. So I think it's going to be really nice. I love it. And you know what's perfect about, you know, junk journaling? It doesn't have to be perfect. I always no. tell him that. So, yeah, I wanted to share those with you guys. I guess today's just like a, today's like a share fest. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, we've been home. We've been safe. Everyone says stay safe and all that. We're we're doing fine. There's no no issues here. You got plenty of toilet paper. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we're fine. Please send toilet tissue. <laughs> I um, I just wrote Rachel with Roxy Creations, and I'm like. Do you need me to send you some tissue? <laughs> she said, no. Um, she said, we didn't all, we didn't freak out like they did. <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I know. Good thing we just, you know, went and bought like a big package of it. So hopefully it'll settle down by the time we need more. <laughs> but she's like, you're so funny. <laughs> well, you know, if I'm mailing something, then, you know, if you need tissue, I'm going to mail you some. <laughs> So look, more paper. See what I mean? It comes in everything. So if I don't let the cats play with it, I'll just kind of iron it in. Yeah. So anyways, yeah, this is from Hobby Lobby. Uh, the thing with Hobby Lobby is, you know, you order it, and then it seriously takes 10 to 12 days a long time, really, to get it. Because I, I ordered it, yeah probably 10 days ago and then I forget what I ordered <laughs> so anyways uh piping hun oh cool yeah that's what I was looking for. so they had a bunch of stuff you know when I order from Hobby Lobby typically it's the items that are currently on sale and Clint was wanting <clears throat> to try some of this piping well they had it in different colors so I think it was like 99 cents or 89 cents yeah, or something so I got one in the three shades I thought we would actually use. Look, there's brown. I could have used that. Make sure you guys can see what I'm doing. But yeah, I got those three. The only reason I know what I had is because I was like, where's my package? And so I looked it up and saw some of the items I have, had ordered. <laughs> I need a cup of coffee for part of my life. Oh, Clint needs well, coffee. It's been chilly all morning. Yeah, it has. Nice. And then I got these dies. Look at those. Those are so fun. So I'm going to see if Clint can take down my die cutter. Because I kind of have it up high and uh, maybe cut out some dies. But I always need a bunch of, you know, just little tags and stuff. So who knows? One of these days I'll get all those cut out. And then I got lace, lace, and more lace. Because they were 50% off right now. So that was really pretty. I got some more of this. So this is kind of like a um, creamy color in the one I had before with white. And I actually used all of that. So, see, I'm replenishing my stash. So, yeah. But now I might be ready to make another lace journal since I have pretty new laces to, to work. Ooh, really pretty. But I'm still working on, you know, my entry to go with, uh, to Rachel with Roxy Creations. So, maybe I can use some of this stuff for that. I probably have tons of this stuff in the bedroom. <laughs> and then, oh, that's pretty. It's kind of like a dangle. And let me just kind of take this other two stuff. I didn't get a whole lot of stuff. It was just stuff that I didn't necessarily need. Did you beat Dad? He is one point ahead of me, and now... <laughs> now he's not? It's, I beat him by three points. Oh, nice. Hot dog! Oh my gosh, guys, look at that. What is it? Ooh. Lace. These are lace That's by the yard. Crazy. Lace by the yard was on sale this time. And, you know, I always watch Diane H. And a lot of times she'll say, you know, she goes and gets this certain lace when it's uh, 
got no room by off the yard lace or whatever. I, mean, I, you are not I have no clue what that is. No, I have to look at it. I don't have any room. But this is that one. Oh, guys, that I used. I think I used it in the peach journal. That one is so pretty. And look at it. They have them all wrapped up, so I can't really take them apart. Well, take I them apart. Mine. No, ma'am. I don't need cat hair all over my pretty lace. I have to unwind it. <laughs> I can show you guys. The thing is, I have I'm out of a lot of ribbons and stuff, so I but I still have the spools because it's kind of set on the back of my um, door, and so I have to take it all apart to take them out. Oh, I used one pretty. of the towels, but well, it was on the floor. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm not worried. About it. Look at that! Isn't that gorgeous, huh? Wow, isn't that pretty? I might have to use some of that. I'm not surprised. He always steals my yeah, stuff. Yeah, but wouldn't that make a beautiful uh, belly band? Cover one? or oh, a belly band? Yeah. Well, and I'm not sure how much of it I used. I knew I got extra of this. I think I got three yards of this because I really loved it. <coughs> and these are probably <coughs> just a yard. Look at that crochet one. Oh, that one's pretty. Really pretty. And then this trim. I love that. How fun! I did good. Yes, you did, baby. <laughs> I'm going to wind this up because if I don't, I'm really going to have issues because Sophia, you know, how, you know how it goes with the critters. <clears throat> but yeah, Clint is, uh, I'm going to tell on you. So he's like, honey, do, should we give the cat milk? Because sometimes we give them milk with only like two of them. Just as a little treat and stuff. And he says, we may have to eat him. He needs to get fatter. Yes. I looked at him and said, well, maybe we should get milk. That way I can fatten his butt up just in case I need to eat him. I said, well, he is the oldest. <laughs> I know you're not supposed to give cats milk, but it's just a little treat. And it's seriously like two or three drops. So. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, but it, I was, I just started tough, laughing. <laughs> We're not going to eat the cats to start with. We have chickens and stuff. If we need to, we can survive on them. Yeah, that's what I said. On I them. Wanna, We're not I as attached to them as we are to the cats. To, <laughs> but we also have goats. You know, goat meat's always good, right? You know what? what that's what my friend this? says. He's always joking. When are you going to give me one of your goats? I've been dying for some goat meat. <laughs> Oh, and we oh, have, shut up. <laughs> we have tiny goats. They're That's what I tell them. Nigerian dwarf goats. So you wouldn't get very much. That's but what I tell them, too. I was thinking, really, hon? Oh. Uh, this is oh, actually a trim, oh, I guess. Good. I, You know, I've been buying <clears throat> beads and stuff, and I was thinking, uh, did I mean to buy these beads? But, you know, that would be really pretty, taken apart and put on one of those bead dangles. Because I don't know how else I would use it. <clears throat> I mean, there's so much... It's pretty good size. I mean, it's probably 10 millimeter or so, 10 to 12. So, yeah. I only know because, you know. You know. I wanted to look at this one, though. Oh, yeah. That one's kind of pretty, though. I just wanted some different things to play with. So, I like that. Fun. I, I really enjoyed myself. Okay, so put this back in here. Oh, it looks like another piece in there. And then, of course, I got one paper pack because everything was 50% off. And then I always use my 40% off card. But look at that, hun. Oh, wow, that's neat. It's kind of like a, um, what's yeah, it called? Foil. Like Sage and stuff. And then look, oh, so pretty. This is called 30 Fleur by Prima. So let's look at it. And I'm still expecting one package, but like I said, it's from Norway. So who knows when that's going to show up. So I just thought instead of having, you know, this one wasn't a huge haul, I would just combine them all together for you guys. But I think that's all we're expecting. Well, all I'm expecting. Oh, I, can get <laughs> I know. 
I got a lot of stuff. But like I said, we got to buy so we can have plenty to craft with. Of course, I could probably craft and not buy another thing for like five years. Yeah, you could. <laughs> Maybe not five years, but I bet you can make it a year. And I could easily make it a year. Probably even crap. with the glue I have. <laughs> yeah. I think you still have crap left over. Too. You think so? Yes. Oh, look at that, guys. That is so pretty. And then like in the... Yeah, you can kind of see it. There's like alphabet letters that are um, foiled. <clears throat> Oh, that is pretty. And that's a color I don't typically use. I love any green. So, it's kind of like a minty green. That's pretty. Sea foam is the word I was thinking of. And this is one of the Prima packs. So, there's like six, four or six sheets of each. Which I like. What does that say? <coughs> I don't know what's scribbled in. Can you see it? So it's kind of black and then it's got scribbles. It's kind of fun. But I do like the back. I don't know what that is. It looks... Hmm. I don't know. Because if I guess, I'm not going to guess correctly. Oh, these are cute. Look at those. Get stuff done. Beautiful note. I wonder if we have any sea foam. Because wouldn't that be a pretty TN, the, these colors? Of course, you can always use a paper. You know, you can always make a cover with paper. But Clint... What fun is that? Yeah, Clint needs to use up some of his fabric. So, he doesn't feel guilty buying more. So I never I'm, feel guilty so buying like, more fabric. <laughs> Maybe other stuff, but not fabric. Oh, that's probably a little tiny bird because it looked like this with the big tail. That's pretty. I like that one. I just kind of saw the colors and I had the other ones, so I wanted to try, you know, a different one. It's just a black and white square. Oh, those are cute. To the world, you may be just one person, but to one person you may be the world. True. So true. That is a really cute paper pad. I told you guys it's from Prima. Yeah. Very pretty. I like it. I like it. And then the circles. I like it. I think it's really fun. And you know, I'm just kind of using or kind of buying just double-sided papers right now. Because I have tons of single-sided, and I really like the double-sided. <coughs> so, anything else? Is that it? I believe that's it. I don't know. I don't think I have anything else to show you guys. I do have this, I guess I can show you. Yeah. That I'm going to send to um, Rachel. And it's still not finished. It's just, I don't know. It's not really my style so much, but I just saw this paper and thought it was so pretty. And so we're going to do this, and then it's just one of my secret journaling spots. It what actually mean, doesn't look so bad, huh? What do you mean it's not your style? Well, I don't know. You know, it just, I guess it doesn't feel finished, but now that I have some laces and stuff, maybe I can put a little extra lace on here. Make it pretty. I don't know. Huh? It's just, I guess, different than what I've been doing. Hmm. You know, like this. It's just like a little side pocket. I did put lace underneath it. And then this one, I put lace under the mm. pocket, too. This one. Is it my style? I don't know. I just was wondering, that's all. I don't know. And then just a piece, a couple of pieces of ephemera that she can um, <coughs> add to her little birthday book. So, anyways... I guess that's all for now. So thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure and hit that subscribe button. Give this video a thumbs up. It really helps out our channel. And we will see you guys in the next video. See you soon. Bye. Bye guys.